All right, guys, so Pokey just stepped in. She is coming upstairs. It's show time. Take everything in at once. <gasps> oh my God. So since I'm upgrading Pokimane's setup, I thought it'd be nice to give one of you guys a chance to upgrade your very own setup watching from home. I've partnered with Karma, who's also sponsoring this video to make this happen, and it is very easy. Once you download the Karma extension using my link below, you can visit any website you want and start adding gear to your list. It could be any gear that you think would be a nice upgrade to your setup across any website like Amazon, Newegg, Best Buy, uh, up to $1,000 though. So once you guys are done shopping, I want you to screenshot your list, go over to my Discord server and post your screenshot on the Karma channel. I'll go and pick one random person and send a thousand dollars. It doesn't matter where you live. As you probably know by now, Karma is a free extension that notifies you when a product you add to your list comes back in stock, drops in price, or has a coupon code available. You can even create separate lists to organize your shopping. I've created two separate lists for myself, one for PC parts and the other for setup gear. Also, did you know, if you're buying something online, Karma will automatically apply a coupon code if there's one available, so you're always getting the best deal out there. But this feature is only available on the browser, so having the extension is a must. You also get Karma Cash on purchases from select retailers, and if that's not enough to get you to download Karma, for every purchase over $50, they donate a dollar to a cause of your choice. So go ahead and try it out for yourself, you guys. Click my link below to download and install the Karma extension to your browser. It's completely free, plus you get a chance to win $1,000 towards your dream setup. What do you got to lose? So five months ago, I reacted to Pokimane's setup, or I should say, roasted her setup. The cables... Stop, 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 I know, I know. Mimi. Mimi. It looks like she lost some weight. Is that another size Literally zero improvement. Zero improvement. I need to go call my therapist. She came across the video and reacted to it live on her Twitch channel. And she took my offer on giving her a setup makeover. Set up makeover? So fast forward five months later, here we are. It is finally time to give Pokey her brand new setup. I loaded everything up in the van already, so it's ready to go. The only thing left to do is to drive it over to her place and redo her setup. Let's go. <laughs> the wind, dude. All right, I have to a bumpy start, but you know what, guys? I think we're good now. It had to be windy today. The one day I'm going over to give a set of makeover, it had to be windy. What is my luck, man? All right. So we had to stop for gas. Um, I want to be honest with you guys, this is uh, my first time feeling gas in like three years. It feels very weird. <laughs> Am I doing this right? You're supposed to stick this in here, right? Usually long thin objects go inside small holes. So this is, I think I'm doing it right. And the one time I'm feeling gas, it happens to be the worst gas prices here in California. What is it now, like 620? 620 something per gallon for like the 87? It's crazy, it's absolutely crazy. All right, there's actually one more stop I wanna make and that is to grab some food. Because I do not wanna build a setup on an empty stomach, that's for sure. Hello. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large. To be honest with you guys, it's not my first choice, but that's the only thing around here right now. Um, right next to the freeway, so... And we're kind of running short on time. So after here, we're heading straight to Pokimane's house. Um, I was told that she's not going to be there. 
which is great because she won't be able to sneak in and take a look at her setup until I'm done with it. So uh, it should give us about five or six hours of daylight to work with. I'm hoping to get done before 6 p.m. and then we can give her a call. She'll come over and take a look at her setup and I just hope she likes it. Alright guys, so we finally made it to Pokimane's house. Her setup is right here inside this room. I'm gonna go take a look at it and um, I'm, I'm a little scared to be honest, but let's go see what she's got. Oh geez. Somehow it's worse in person, I feared. I've actually never seen this before, but there's a bunch of like acoustic panels attached on the, on the wall. There's like black ones, there's some blue ones. And even the Elgato panels fell down. I think there's a lot more work that needs to be done. The setup does look a little different compared to the pictures that was sent to me like over five months ago. So this is it, this is Pokemon's setup. I love how she has her flask right here, kind of just waiting for me. I got a feeling she cleaned up a little bit. In the pictures, there was a lot of more, there was more mess, like her makeup brushes and stuff were on the, uh, scattered across the desk. I really think she just needs a nice bigger desk and more functionality added to the setup. And that's kind of my goal here is to not only give her a setup makeover, but bring back the functionality and synergy that her current setup is missing. Should we take a look at cable management, folks? Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty bad, but it's not something I can't handle. This portion over here is also loose, as you can tell. Is this screw missing? Yep, screw is missing. So this is basically the famous background during her streams. Uh, I don't think I'll touch much in this area. I'm, only gonna, I'm, all, I'm also gonna focus on the setup. Um, it's got a nut button as well. Nut. Why does everybody have a nut button? I might get one myself, to be honest. She has two, maybe I'll ask if I can take one home. I'm just kidding. Um, we got Gordon Ram Ramsay over here. And then over here on this side, we do have some extra lighting stuff that Nanoleaf has sent her. We do have the mini triangles, or the regular triangles as well, and a few other panels here. So we'll kind of see, once we're done building the setup, we'll kind of see how we can decorate the, um, the wall or the surroundings with those. But. I wanna focus on the setup mostly and get this situated before we can do anything else. My only other concern is these acoustic panels. I honestly don't think they make any difference, um, especially being this spread out, but I didn't really bring any, bring any acoustic panels with me, so I think I might have to just leave these here. Can I peel these off? Nope, you cannot peel those off. I did not do that. That was not, that was already, it was already like that. I can see why she left these hooks because a piece of the wall is gonna come off with it. So fortunately there's not much I can do there because the damage is already, you can actually even see over here, some mistakes were made against the wall here. Oh man. There's a lot of cat hair on this. All right, set up makeover successful, time to go home. So yeah, um, I think I've seen enough, you guys. I know that Iman isn't a messy person. I feel like she's just a lost soul that needs some guidance to go back on the right track. And that's, that's why I'm here. Normally this is where I would let the person who owns the setup kind of say their goodbyes or their final words, but since Iman isn't here, I will be saying it for her. Dear Pokemon setup, um, I just want you to know that Iman is very grateful for everything you've done for her. Um, I'm sure you guys have made some amazing memories together and she will forever be grateful. But unfortunately, it's time for her to move on to something better, to something bigger, and something that will 
satisfy her a lot more than you have ever will. And now a moment of silence. All right, that's enough. Start taking this apart. These lights are gonna get in the way. There's a lot of lights in this room, in this small room. So I think the first thing I wanna do is remove these lights so we have the extra space to work with. And then if we need these, we'll just bring it back in at the end. All right guys, so that was a lot of work, but finally stripped down her setup. This is what remains of it. We're gonna remove the desk and um, see if we can actually give it away to somebody and then bring in over uh, her new desk, which is downstairs, along with the rest of her new gear for the setup. So yeah, let's get moving. Gordon is always getting in the way. Come on, Gordon, behave. Gordon just wants to be involved. Can you please just stay there? You donkey! Uh, we got a power strip underneath here, so I think we're good. All right, so it is now one o'clock. We got here at, I think, 11.30, was it? So we've been here for about an hour and a half. We took apart the setup and we bought a new desk so far, which means we only have about five more hours to complete the setup. We're cutting it pretty close, but I think, I think we can do it. It's almost two o'clock p.m. and honestly guys, I am beat. I am out of energy. My back is killing me. I am not in the same shape as I used to be apparently. But yeah, this, this setup is kicking my ass for sure. But we're almost done. I would say another couple hours on the cable management and uh, we should be ready to go. But first I'm gonna take a nap. Oh my God, Mimi's here. Hi, Mimi. How are you? You probably don't recognize me, but um, you and I kind of got off on the wrong foot. She is huge. Is that a normal size for a cat? So I wanna, I wanna make it up to you. I'll bite you a gift. I'll bite you some gifts, I should say. Look, so many toys for you. I hope you can take this as a token of my appreciation and apology. I think, I think she likes it. How about this one? They say you like strings. Yes, she's coming. 
You like this one? Yeah. <laughs> How about this one? Well, you have a bunch of choi uh, toys to choose from, Mimi. This is all yours. Oh, she likes it. She likes the toys. Yeah, let me open it for you. There you go. It's all yours. You like your new toys, Mimi? All right. I'm glad you like it. It was nice to meet you in person, finally. Okay, well, management is an easy task. Don't you agree, Mimi? Yep, just managing cables back here. Mimi is keeping me company. So, um, how's life? How is Pokemon treating you? Oh God, oh God, oh God. Does this mean we're friends? Are we finally friends? I would assume so, otherwise you wouldn't be this close to me. You wanna shake on it? She bit me. She bit me. <laughs> uh, uh, I think that's a, good, that's a good sign, right? That's gotta be a good sign. That means all is forgiven. All right, guys, so it is 4, 12 p.m. So we've been here about four and a half hours. The setup is finally done. Um, but we still have to do a few more finishing touches with her, um, with her background over here. Um, her manager told me that she is actually on the way. She'll be here in about an hour. So we're cutting it a little close, but I think we're going to make it. So there's some artwork I want to put here against the wall right over here. Cause there's an empty spot, which I think will look nice. And plus it'll complement her Pokemon banner on the opposite side. This is V1 Tech's new plexiglass wall art that they sent over. Uh, super high resolution prints on something that looks like glass, but it's shadow resistant. I'm actually getting two of these for my personal setup. I'm getting it with the uh, wooden frame and RGB backlit. It's gonna look freaking epic inside my setup. But yeah, uh, they do have a bunch of different designs to choose from. You can even upload your own artwork if you guys want. But if you wanna pick one up for yourself, I'll drop a link to it below. Just use my code TechSource to get 20% off. So apparently this is, uh, it attaches on like Velcro. It's gonna put one in each corner just so I can make sure it doesn't fall off later. All right, look at that. We just have to move Pikachu's big head just a little bit so we can see the beautiful artwork. Oops. Let's put this here. Look at that. How much cleaner that looks. That looks nice. All right guys, so Pokey just stepped in. She is coming upstairs. It's your time. Thank you for putting in so much work and effort. Don't Jesus. thank me yet. I just, I hope you like your setup. And then if you do, then you can thank me at the end, okay? If Mimi likes it all. I think <laughs> she true. loves it. She was like sleeping on the setup the entire oh, time. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. Take everything in at once. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> I feel like there was so much more. What oh the my heck? God. Yeah. 
You got a new desk? A new desk? Yeah, about a few things a we kind of changed up. A whole new desk? Yeah. It's about time we upgraded your tiny desk. And the posters I wanted. Thank you so much. You're thank you. Thank You're you. Welcome. Thank you. What the heck? You're welcome. Oh my god. So much more space, so right? So much yes. more space to move around. I'm like, I, I think there were more things in here. Where did they all go? <laughs> nice. So, can, I, can I sit? Can I get yeah. a feel for it? You know? Absolutely. Go ahead. Yeah, so we made some nice, you know, space It looks here. so pretty. Okay, here's the thing. My stream setup always looks decent one way, but horrendous the other way. Uh, actually, and, open up your OBS. You'll see what it looks like on, uh, on the screen. And you made it look just good all around. Thank you. Valorant background. <laughs> Hello. Oh what do you think? God, that's Does so, it look good on the screen? It looks so good. When did you first start streaming? Oh my god, I started streaming, I think, right at the end of 2013. I was 17. I was halfway through my senior year in high school. Wow. Yeah. So I guess a follow-up to that is what got you into streaming? Honestly, I... Not many people at my high school played games, mm -hmm. but I had some friends in neighboring high schools that would play, and we'd play League every day after school. And sometimes they would send me links to other people's streams. Okay. And especially watching other female streamers, I was like, this looks so fun. Like meeting other streamers that play, playing together, making content out of that, even just interacting with other people. Mm -hmm. I just thought it looked really freaking fun. So I saved up, I bought like a $300 used PC off of <laughs> Canadian Craigslist, it's called oh, Kijiji. Geez. Yeah. Okay, I never even heard so, of it. So, yeah, so I bought a used custom built PC and the rest is history. The rest is history. Here yeah. we are. Wow. <laughs> Did you see the cable management? There's, there's no more nothing. cables. No there's, more cables. There is no. Oh, that's where they all are. <laughs> oh. How's it just, like, is everything wireless in here? Wireless, or? right? Wait, this is insane. How My brain can't. It, yeah, <laughs> when it comes take a to moment. table management, just head empty. Yeah, I can't. yeah absolutely. I do want to progress update every three months to make sure you maintain the setup like this. Uh, or at least similar, you know. <laughs> I will do it. I will do it. So let me let me talk a little oh, about the setup yeah, I'm and some changes. Yeah, it. Um, let's start with the desk. Obviously, Holy. it's a bit bigger. Wait, okay. Can I just say yeah, you like? Yeah, you rearranged everything, amazing, but you also cleaned everything. That's part of the job. <laughs> thank That's you, part of the job. We gotta clean. We can't keep you. Know, we can't keep the same mask. Thank so. you so much. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, so yeah, the desk obviously is something bigger. Um, yeah. It's also motorized, so you can adjust the, the height on there if you like. It I don't doesn't know how have to go up too high to be short <laughs> when I sit. Um, <laughs> but the main thing is, my whole goal for the setup was to kind mm -hmm. of bring back the functionality and the synergy, which your last setup was lacking quite a bit. I wanted to make this more comfortable yeah, yeah. to use. You have to roast me like that. <laughs> more comfortable to use, more easy to use. Obviously you're streaming, like how many hours a day do you usually stream? Uh, like four to six, eight, okay. something like that. So that's, yeah. the setup is a big part of your life. It I is. Say. I, I mean, more than I stream, I'm on the PC like all day. Offline too, exactly. Yeah, exactly. So obviously that's what I wanted to do, to kind of bring back the functionality, make it easy mm -hmm. to access things. As you can see, I bought your GoXLR in the front now. Oh, it's easier to access. Oh, that's so useful, actually. And I didn't know they made stands like that for it. They, they don't. It's actually custom printed, 3D printed. So it's, a, it's at an angle, they so don't. it's easier to use. It's custom. I mean, you can technically buy it if you want. <laughs> oh my god, that's so um, freaking sick. Your Elgato Stream Mix is also closer. So, you know, again, convenience. Everything's about convenience. So I got you a little yes, um, do container. It you. Oh, it looks nice. That's so cute. But check this out. <laughs> this um, I'm a big firm believer in storage so I added some extra storage oh. to keep the clean to keep the surface clean so yeah. check it out there's a storage thing here pull it out the pencil drill get your makeup stuff there come over here on this side there's one over there Wait, hold on. <laughs> we'll be right back <laughs> and then there's one over there a much wider one wow. for more makeup stuff so where the main is this desk from Oh, this is just an Ikea. It's an Ikea backend. It's an Ikea desk? It's an Ikea desk, and then I bought the motorized base on Amazon separately, and I just installed it on it. So and this comes with... No, 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 those I, I added myself to. 
on Amazon. Pencil drawers, you've heard of pencil drawers. Yeah, but the fact that you put it all together, amazing. Thank you. Uh, I hope you do use it. The, the set of God. <laughs> Thank you. Um, but yeah. I... Okay, maybe if I even like upgraded some things, then I'll like resubmit this in your like setup, setup boards. boards. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I want to see this. I want to see this uh, submission. Added a couple things. Exactly. Personalized it even more. Exactly. Okay, How let's talk. You... Yeah, the what? I so, yeah, let's talk about the lights. I know you're not a huge fan. I think you've tried these before and they're not too harsh. Not these in particular. I've okay. tried the ones that are a bit bigger. Okay, so the original yeah. uh, key lights. Okay, yeah. these are the key light errors. They're smaller, mm -hmm. but they still pack a nice punch. But honestly, I think these are so much better than the four or five. Yeah, five different lightings. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. They're in the no, living room, okay? This, this place, I walked in here, I was like this. I couldn't. <laughs> I couldn't okay. move. <laughs> My room gets so hot because of that. Because too. of the lights, yeah. yeah. I, I was like sweating at one point, and the lights weren't even on, so I could imagine how hot it Actually, would be. Now that I think, I came in and I was like, this room is so much emptier than before, but it's probably because I had like five lights. Yeah, it was it was insane. Uh, you had random acoustic panels. I don't know who did this. Who did this, by the way? It wasn't her. It wasn't Lynn. I asked her. It was you. Yeah, it was a very, very bad idea. I don't know. <laughs> I have no words. I have no words. So I just went around my whole room and I just. Oh my god. I just slapped these on and then I just stabbed these on. <laughs> Wait, okay, but to be fair, it worked. Like it, it did, it did the job. Are you sure for it wasn't the just the, the rug that was doing it? The rug helped. The too, rug okay? helped. Okay. And then um, I mean, they looked not the cutest, and I could tell like what I needed the most was. I guess like the direction in which I was yes. speaking. Mm -hmm. So I had a friend help set these and those up. Mm -hmm. But then because I was having my lights face this way, they weren't bouncing back very uh, well. So, so that's I took why you some took off. Them out. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, that made sense. But yeah, and then when I peeled off a couple of those, I, I can see some damages in the walls already from the previous ones. So I covered it with if these. If my landlord is watching, no, you're not. Yeah, no, that, that never happened actually. No, you're we'll, not. We'll, cut that, we'll cut that out. <laughs> You know, I've never in my whole gaming career, not just streaming, I've never had a desktop on my desk. That was one of the reasons it was bothering me. You had the PC on the floor and it's like, you gotta appreciate the PCs. They're, they're beautiful, it's beautiful. You got your logo oh on there too. Oh my God, you guys put the thing back on. This looks so sick. Right, and you can see it. We roll zoom with that, it looks right? so good. <laughs> we did, we got, we got some nice video on that. So you can see it now while you're streaming. Oh, you know it actually down. Sick. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. Wow. Oh. It's nice. What else? Uh, I didn't touch your microphone, boom arm. It's a nice setup you got there. I actually have the same microphone myself. It's... Have you even put the headset on? So oh, speaking. Yeah. yeah, I know. I should have got you a headphone anchor. I failed. <laughs> I failed her. I didn't get her a headphone anchor, man. Mm, but nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. I know. I'm, I can't so believe there's such little wires. Like it's blowing my brain. <laughs> I'm used to a sea of them. As you know. I noticed. I noticed when I was roasting you. So what would you say is the most like rewarding thing about streaming? I think is just being able to have an impact on another human being, even if it's through the internet, even if it's just by, you know, cheering them up for like a slight bit of their day. And you especially get to see it, I think when you meet people in person, like if you meet someone and they become like so emotional that they cry, that just blows my mind. It's crazy. Yeah, and I think it really goes to show the impact that streamers can have on other people's lives. But also, I've been on the other end of that situation. Like the first time I met my favorite streamer, I also cried seeing them. Oh, really? Yes. Who was it? <laughs> it was Amaz. He's oh, a okay. Hearthstone streamer. Um, I met him <laughs> like so many years ago, oh, and God. this was still when I was in a, in college, university. And I would study engineering, but during half of my engineering classes, I was just watching Twitch streams. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that's what everyone does now though. It's cool. Right, yeah. So, yeah. When they become just like a part of your everyday life almost, and you get to see them in person, it's so surreal. And then seeing like the ro the rules be reversed and people react that way to me, it just like, yeah. Absolutely, yeah. Blows my mind. So uh, I guess on the opposite spectrum of that question, what is the most challenging part about streaming? Uh, the most challenging part about streaming is definitely the fact that your job entails revolving what you do around a feedback loop of people's opinions. Mm -hmm. So for example, if you post a YouTube video, obviously your community and the feedback that they give you is an equation of that, but you're not seeing that as you're filming, you're not seeing that like while you're making the content, it's almost like 
um, like a byproduct of it. Right. But when you're streaming, like you have to read chat, you have to see what people are saying. And if any of that is negative or difficult to read, you have to learn how to kind of endure that or Adapt be resilient. Exactly. Yeah. So I wow. guess that's the toughest part, dealing with other people's opinions, especially when let's say they see you for like three minutes, make some massive judgment based off of the three minutes that they know you. Um, and then just say whatever and move on. Yeah. You still have to kind of deal with that judgment and kind of process wow. it however you can. I didn't even think of it that way, but that's, mm -hmm. that's wow. Especially like new streamers, that's uh, really yes. tough for them. If yeah. they're trying to get their foot in the door and when they see negative comments, stuff like that, it's mm -hmm. kind of disheartening and uh, difficult. Absolutely, know, that's why I hope that most people are kinder to smaller streamers or up and coming streamers. This is absolutely <laughs> insane. Like, I wish there was a service people could use to just like deck out their setups. Cause I'm sure it exists out there. I should probably start one, right? If anything, just watch his videos. Yeah, that'll be cool. Your um, setup knowledge is. Thank you. Yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been doing it for for such a long time. It's like DNA embedded yeah. in me at this point. Um, one thing I do want to show you actually, uh -huh. your camera. It's on a really cool quick release mount. I needed a new mount. Okay, the one that I had, every time I, ha ah, ha my whole camera just, just, and then I spent half the stream and completely. Oh my God. Like, my viewers know, they will thank you for this. They yeah, really no, this, this is really cool. You press the buttons over here, mm -hmm. and you can basically pull it out. So oh, it's a quick release mount. Oh my God. You I'm can just, disconnect it, yeah. The camera, the arms, does this yeah. move easily? Okay, okay, I'm glad you mentioned that. I'm glad you mentioned the monitor. So let me let me tell you something, okay? Mm -hmm. Talk to me. You don't like monitor mounts. You made I, it clear. Yeah. You made it clear. They move around a lot. It does look really good though. But you haven't experienced this one because this is one of the most sturdiest ones that you can buy. Give it a chance. We still have the old mounts if you don't like it. Listen, Give it a chance, you're I'm gonna love it. I'm open-minded. Okay, you're gonna I love it. I hate the arms, pretty, but I'm open-minded. They're pretty sturdy. I mean, you don't have oh, to- Oh, actually, that one does look pretty sturdy. You mean he taped? I taped it so it doesn't move tape. because, don't show that, hey, hey, no, cut that. No, you need it, cut it that. looks so funny. <laughs> cut the little that. monitors are duct taped together at the back. It's gaffer tape, but yeah, don't show that. But we'll cut, we'll it cut looks that Yeah, I mean, let me know what you want. Overall rating, what would you say out of, uh, out of 10? And you have to be honest. Include the tape, you know, include the moderate amount. What, what is it? I'm calculating. Calculate. Okay, so you have... Clean mouse pad too, keyboard, everything mouse. Everything aesthetically, very pleasing. You okay. even have like a certain colorway that you stuck to for both sides. Thank you. Which is amazing. Um, however, I will have to dock you half a point for the duct tape. Half a point, that's half generous. Half a point, half a point. That's generous. And half a point because the arm isn't movable and I don't know if it's gonna be at my eye level, you know what I mean? Okay, okay, so, fair enough. Aside from that, I'm pretty open-minded. I think the rest is like a nine out of 10. I don't even know what I could possibly suggest. I like that rating. No, to good. improve it. Yeah, better modern amount. Also, <laughs> the cable management. No, like you guys need a full, it's out of this world. Thank you. Thank it you was. so much. Yeah, thank Please, can you guys like like, comment, and subscribe? Because he deserves it. He put in so much work and he won't let me pay him. So this is the only payment I can give. Please comment. This is for there reimbursement. <laughs> reimbursement. I can rationalize. Thank you so much. You're absolutely welcome. It was a pleasure <laughs> doing this for you. I actually No, a lot it's of fun. gonna be a pleasure gaming on this and looking around and it being beautiful. So maybe this is the gateway to other streamers watching this video. Yeah. If you guys need a, a highly recommend. Over. I mean, like, look at this place. It's Pokimane approved. Can we put a stamp? <laughs> Can we official stamp on this one? There it is. Five stamps. <laughs> Why did you decide to accept my offer and giving you a set of makeover? Dude. You could have done it yourself. They, you could have found other no, people no. to do it for you. No one can do it like you can do it. Like this is literally <laughs> your bread and butter. This is such a silly question. It's like, so why did you let me come into your home and clean your stream room and make it look better? Because it's a no brainer. What do you mean? I mean, to But you. also because like, there aren't many people who specialize in this sort of thing. Mm. Like. I could probably get someone to do a thing here and there, set something up or come in and try to do my audio, but no one specializes in bringing it all together and knows a lot about every single piece or even like the 
custom thing to have the stream deck up. Like, who could I ask for a suggestion oh, for or recommendation yeah. like that, right? So. I appreciate yeah. that, yeah. That Why? Because it's a no brainer. Well, yeah, I think that's pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope Thank you, you for watching. <laughs> Season eight applications are now open. Uh, if you guys need a setup makeover, I'm gonna come over to your place, eat your food, you drink your water, and I'll uh, give you a setup makeover. Toss an application over on the Discord. You won't regret it. <laughs> I pinky promise. You won't regret it. There you it. go, there you go. I cannot wait to show this on my stream. This which you can live... include afterwards too. I'll be streaming tomorrow. Oh, great, okay. Yeah, so we'll see how it looks. This the is a test. uh, testimonial right here from uh, from Bunky Man. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Two thumbs uh, up for me. Absolute pleasure again. Pokemon. No, it was absolutely my pleasure. Absolutely. You came in and redid my whole stream room and then cleaned it and it was your pleasure? Are you joking me? Yeah. So thank you. Thank You're you welcome. very much. Absolutely. I'm so excited so, to yeah. stream. See you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>